strange scenario. Trevor Gleeson was the assistant to Andre Lamanis at the Boomers as Casey Prater finds the first bucket of the night. Most of them will be Brisbane, but Perth actually made an OK start to the game. And he does enough to win it back quickly up the floor. McKay to Prater, upstairs goes Casey Prater. And that's what we were just talking about. Here is Craig, and guarded by Hire, and blocked away by McKay. Sort of like a fly, that one. They've made it the last few possessions, they're going to pick that up. Kenny, and the dribble moves straight to the hoop, and lays it in for two. Good intent there from Jared. A real heart-to-heart -heart amongst all the players and the coaching staff. Joe Kenny goes to work and he'll back it in for a couple. Turn around, jumper, no good. Here goes the speed of Mason Bragg and Prather in support, but all the way to the hook. Mason Bragg trying to ignite the Perth Wildcats. And they are matching the Wildcats play for play. Good passing there from Perth to advance the ball. McKay will finish it up. I've certainly been in this position many, many times, and there's two things you can do. One, you can give the ball to Martin Cavallini. If Casey Prather takes it to the hoop, you're newly, you're, you're lish. And right now for the Cats, who have they got that is going to step up? Nice little floater there for Brad. Who do they have that is going? Driving the lane, a high arcing shot. That wouldn't drop, and McKay able to fight his way back and put it in. Five on the shot clock for Prater. Little hop, step, and a skip through the lane. And another two for Casey Prater. They'll go again. Now Kenny, five on the shot clock. Into trouble, just had to throw it up. And he'll get it to drop. Regardless of how, what the outcome is. Prater, he shoots a three. Maybe that'll score the Wildcats. And that halftime deficit has been cut in half. It's back to ten as Bruce loses it across to Redditch. Now things just start to go the Wildcats' way. Johnson, by Kenny. Little stagnant on the offensive end, so Kenny just unleashes a bomb himself. The Wildcats next game, that might end as Kenny with one on the shot clock. Had to throw it up, and Jamil McKay goes to work under the bucket. It's going to be a successful return to the Perth Arena for those two former Wildcats as Greg Hire lets one fly, and he finds the bottom of the bucket. Great story, as well as Tom Jervis working in the mining industry as Brad goes to work here. Against Cairns in the 2015 semi-finals. Redditch, he drives in, and the scoring machine goes to work. Just over a minute remaining. Craig advancing to the ball, and even bigger block by Jared Johnson. Right in the face of Daniel Kickett, and then higher back the other way, lays it in for two. Uncharted territory for the Wildcats as Rowe drives the lane, and he finishes.